Yes, we got him. Oh, we got it. Oh. Oh, now, now I've got to release him or kill him. I don't even know if I can do that. All right, look away, guys. Look away. Three, two, one. Hey, I'm Drubs. Welcome back to the Latana Army. I'm Litz, and this is the Long Dark. And we've just survived in this cave. So we had the big plane crash in the last episode. And what we've actually done now, we had this little bed here that we conveniently found in this cave. So we made a little fire. We slept next to some really creepy looking bones here. I don't know what they are. But, you know, what we're going to do is go out now and see if we can find Astrid. I have no idea where she is. I'm just going to pick up stuff. Like, as we're going. Now, I've the controls are always a little bit tricky. Do you know when you're playing a new game and you've just got to get used to the controls? This looks important. <laughs> just take stuff that we think is important. Right, here we go. So, just a little bit of wood just to keep us going. Because you never know. Oh, we can search a container here. What's in here? Some trusty matches and... Oh, wow. Okay, so we've got quite a few stuff in there, which is great. Okay, so let's make our way up. Wood. Uh, now, I think we can get over this conveniently felled tree. <laughs> What's going to get us up here? Now, there's no other way down, so we've got to get up. And I think the plane, look, the end of the plane's up there. So that's what I'm trying to get to. So let's just keep on moving. We got this. All right, good. And this wood here looks pretty tempting. So we're going to take this. And I'm just going to probably climb that. Oh. All right. Well, I was going to do that anyway, but okay. I suppose it seems we're on the right track. All right, so climb. Here we go. You got this, Will. The protagonist's name, the main guy who we're using now is Will McKenzie. And he was traveling with his wife, Astrid, who he's not with anymore. And he's not seen her for years, but she wanted this one favor, which was to fly her into a snowstorm so she could get to some sort of patient, because she's a doctor, we think. So, that's kind of where we are right now. So we're just surviving in Canada. I've never been to Canada. I don't know if this is what Canada's like. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it is. I'm guessing, though, the uh, the Thomas Cook plane that would take me there probably wouldn't crash and leave me stranded like so. Can we climb that one? Yes, we can. All right, let's keep going up. All right, life is pretty good right now. Well, it's not good. We're in a plane crash in the middle of a frosty tundra, but still. Make it. Yeah, look, Will's positive like me. He thinks we're going to make it too. Okay, I don't think we can eat the rose hip, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna kind of keep going up the mountain. <laughs> you can kind of hear the sticks like clanging as he's walking as well. That's always good. All right, more rose hip. Yeah, I don't know what it's for, but we're going to get loads of it. If all else fails and they find a body in the Canadian wastelands or Canadian tundra, then they're going to find us with a ton of rose hip on us. You know what? I'm not even going to collect that lot. Let's leave that. Let's Finally leave that lot there. Made it. Okay. What the hell is up here? How do I run? Can I run? Oh, RB. Okay. RB to run, people. In case you didn't know. Oh, the plane. My plane. Not sure which of us looks worse. Poor girl. This isn't how things were supposed to end. Okay. Well, yeah, that's true. All right. So let's just get more wood as well. I don't like doing loads of gathering in games. I like to do that off camera. But do you know what? I think we're going to need it. So I just need to get a few sticks. Just to make myself... Oh, the jacket. I've been looking for you. Oh, yeah. A little bit seductive there, Will, but okay. So let's search the backpack. Crunchy stuff. Fat-free. Kind of the last thing we want is the fat-free version. Okay, we've got some gloves and some antibiotics. Astrid's All right. Pack. Ooh. This was the pack that Astrid wouldn't let us look in on the last episode. I wonder what's inside. Locked. Of course it is. I'd love Whatever to know what's in, in there. Case, Astrid was ready to die for it. I hope she hasn't already died for it. Okay, we also got a bedroll, so that'll be useful. And tons of pharmaceutical stuff. So let's take all this lot. I think we're in quite a good spot right now. Do you know, we're not, like, injured. We're not dying. Uh, our food and health is okay. It's not great, but it's okay. And I've got loads of sticks. We always need sticks. Ooh, and cloth for bandages. All right, let's get up here. Wait a minute. Oh, it's a flare. All right. Do you know when you see something in the corner of your eye? All right, more rose hip. I think she we've definitely got... passed through here. And in a hurry. Oh. So this is hers then. Okay, all right. 
I'll be sidetracked, Will. But you know when you see something in the corner of your eye, and then you think, no, nah, I didn't. And then you have to go back and check. Well, that just happened. <laughs> All right. How many, how many sticks have we actually got? Let's have a look. Can't so, my hand. Oh. Oh, we got the gloves, though, Will. Um, all right, let's put, the, let's put the gloves on. So the gloves are on. The gloves are on. And we've got the jacket as well. All right, there you go, Will. How's, how's that feel? Feel good? Okay, so we're gonna... Oh, that's, that's the radial. I don't need that yet. So we're making our way down here. Find stones and equip them to throw rabbits and stun them. Oh, okay. All right, so pick up some stones... Let's get some little stones here. How many is that? I think we've got like four. Let's go and get some more. Oh, look at the rabbits. Oh, hello. All right. So here we go. And we're just going to get loads of these ready. Because I think we're going to need them. So we need to stun a rabbit. Okay, look. We've got to eat, right? Guys got to eat. So let's just make our way... Oh, look, there's loads of stones over here. I'm going to pick them all up. Because I think this is going to be really hard. I could never do this in the survival version of this game. So I can't see it being any easier. This will probably take me about 50 stones. Right, look, we've got 10 stones. That's enough. That's enough. Oh, look, there's some little rabbit dudes over there. Can I... Can I... Oh, I missed him. So near. <laughs> Someone's been here recently. Oh. Could it have been Astrid? I know, Will. It could have been. But they've left all the fire-making stuff nearby, which is really useful for us. Okay, look. There's a rabbit there. I don't know. I don't know, like... <laughs> oh, my God. That was miles off. All right, look. This this could take a while. We may need, we may need a cutscene while I throw stones at rabbits. She's going to crouch. Silent Will. Stay still, Will. Stay still. Stay still. Too early, Will. God damn it. Yes, we got him. Oh, we got it. Oh. Oh, now, now I've got to release him or kill him. I don't even know if I can do that. All right, look away, guys. Look away. Three, two, one. Oh, he shows you as well. That was horrible. Oh, I did not need to see it. I did not need to see it. Oh, my God. All right, well, look, look, it's not my fault. Don't hate me for that. I'm sorry. I do feel bad if it helps anyone. All the rabbits have scattered because Flopsy has just died. <laughs> All right. Okay. Look, it's a circle of life, people. Damn it. Um, look, I think we've got enough there. I'm going to make a little fire here and I'm, I'm going to have to cook him. Just so you know, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> Killing rabbits. Oh my god. All right. So we're starting a little fire up here. Here we go Life is pretty good right now got me some rabbit meat And I've got the little knife as well so I can start skinning the rabbit and doing all of the horrible stuff Now this is why it's good that we collected all the fuel Um, Sticks look we've got 15 so if we just put like Oh no Leave ourselves five sticks Right. Yeah five sticks will be enough uh, okay, so we go into the inventory then. I still feel bad about that. <laughs> right, okay, look. You can't feel bad. It's just food, right? Oh, there he is. Look. Look at him. So we'll harvest the meat. 3.2 3 pounds of meat. That's one heavy rabbit. Um, and then we'll just harvest it, I guess. So, oh, that sounds horrible. There we go. Good. Good. All right. So we need to cook then. So we'll put the rabbit meat on there. And I'm going to need some water, so we'll put that on there. We put the cup on here, and we melt snow in there. Right, so that snow's going to take 19 minutes, and the rabbit's going to take 36. Now, you can speed up time. You just press X on it. Just do that again. There we go. Oh, is the rabbit ready? Yeah, look, the rabbit's cooked, so we can eat that. Fresh rabbit cooked. There we go. Good. And we can drink the water as well. Drink that. So how's the vital signs looking? All right, we could do with more of that, to be fair. But you know what? For now, we're okay. So our food... Oh, we can cook the other rabbit. I don't think I've got enough wood. Oh, it's too windy to start a fire there. All right. Okay. Oh, what is that? 
Uh, all right, there's probably more signs of Astrid. We need to get more wood in case we need another fire, though, right? Okay, but everything else seems okay. We can break this up. We can get three wood from this. Okay. Oh, the rabbit. I feel like the violin music is playing for the rabbit. <laughs> Are we still crouched? No, we're just walking really slow. Probably because of the wind. Where did you go? Oh. What is that? Is that a wolf? Hey, maybe we can scare it off the carcass. Alright, I'm just going to approach the wolf slowly. God, man, is this what Canada's like? Is that a wolf? I just said that, Will. Better keep my distance. Keep my distance. No, we're going to throw a flare. Ah! Oh. Ha! Ah! Alright, good. I'm just going to keep that. We'll just keep the flare, like, here nearby. And then we'll get all this meat off this carcass and the hide and the guts. Because you can make stuff with guts. <gasps> the flare's gone out. Damn it, we better run. Um, that was up the hill. Okay, this is down the hill. I'm just gonna run. I'm just gonna run for the hills. <laughs> and just hope that the the wolf doesn't see us. Whoa. Whoa. Looks like some kind of Jeez, I thought we'd fell off. I must be closer to civilization than I thought. Oh, so a radio tower. Okay, well we've gotta go and see what that is. So let's get down here. Oh, more more rose hip. I see it. Good. Oh, can you hear those wolves? All right, how am I clanging with so many sticks when we have hardly got any sticks? Okay, I don't need more pebbles. If anything, I do need sticks. All right, look, there's a big branch here. Let's go and get this. Oh, needs a hatchet to break it down. Well, we don't have one of those. Maybe I, I can break the branch down. Okay, let's just keep on moving. Ah, a sign. Let's go. Let's see what this is. Radar tower. <laughs> so the radar tower's up there. Uh, ooh, more rose hip will take you. Thanks. The cold is making my head feel thick. Yes, I know, Will. I know it's cold. Stop telling me all the time. Oh, we found a cave. I don't know if this is safe or not. Oh, we got coal. So that'll keep the fire burning for longer. So that's good. All right, maybe we should make a fire in here and camp for now. So let's make a fire. Um, do this, this, and we'll put the fire here. You got this fire. I know you have. And then we can cook that deer meat that we got as well. We can get that like, really full now. Okay, let's add fuel to this. Um, so we'll add sticks. It's loads of sticks. Okay, good. The reclaimed wood can go on. Oh, look. The, the, few, the coal can't be added for another 24. Okay. And uh, there's nothing in here. <laughs> All right. Should we put the bedroll down? Uh, is that this? There we go. Look. So we'll put a little fancy bedroll down here. Look at us making camp in a cave. Eating raw meat before eating it to avoid danger. Oh, cook raw meat. I thought it said eat raw meat. Bad advice. All right, so let's uh, game of venison. Oh, there's loads here. Look, we've got the rabbit. We're going to cook that. And I'm going to get some water as well. So we'll melt that snow. We'll just go fishing around here for some... Uh, see if we can find any more of that coal. Because I think that's going to make the fire last for ages. Um, all right, maybe not. Can I put the coal on now? Nope, needs another 14. So that's 13 minutes, and this one is 15 minutes. All right, well, let's just wait for that to pass. Then we can eat the rabbit meat. Om nom nom nom, thank you. And I want to cook some deer. I'm fancying a little bit of venison right now. God, look at us. We've got, like, venison cooked over a cedar barbecue. Life is great. So if we, if we wait for that, look, that's portable now, so I can just take it. And then I'll make some more. Okay, because why not, right? 38 minutes, and that's going to take 18 minutes. All right, wait till the time's passed. And we'll wait till the time's passed again. So is that cooked now? Venison cooked, so we can eat that. Ha <laughs> ha! All right, now we should be able to put the coal on now. So add fuel, coal, two, three. Look at that. We've got like five hours. Portable water, so take that. So how much water have we got now? 
The problem you've got to remember is water's like heavy as well. So we've got to like be careful how much we do take with us. Water that is safe to drink. All right, good. And I'm going to cook some more medicine. Just because, you know what? While we've got it, why not? And let's cook some more snow. So we're melting snow and cooking venison. I really should keep an eye on the entrance. But we are kind of around the corner. So I think we should be okay. I think that the wolves and stuff will stay away from us. All right, so let's just speed that up then. So past time. Past time. There we go. And we're just going to take that this time. And I'm going to take the can. Pick that up. Cooked venison. And I'm just going to eat that. We're just going to try and get as full as what we can. All right, good. And we're going to leave it there, guys. I'm going to sleep here for the night. Uh, there's a raging snowstorm outside. <laughs> but we found a second thing now. And what we're going to do next on the next episode is go up to that tower and see what we can find up in the radio tower. Guys, look, massive, massive thanks for watching this. I know, obviously, uh, this channel was built on other games and stuff like that. So I really appreciate you guys, especially you guys that have got to this point. This is why I've put this little thank you here. But you guys that have got to this point in the video and you're still watching the videos all the way through, it just means the absolute world to me. So massive, massive thank you. And I will catch you guys on the next video. Thanks for watching, guys.